everybody, this is Jason with Breaking Waves here, here to bring you another, not quite an unboxing, but rather an installation, if you will. Now, I've been wanting to get an SSD as a boot drive for quite a long time, and I think to be precise, when they first started appearing, when I had my, uh, when I was thinking about getting a Mac Mini, um, it was just back in like 2008, and I've been looking at it ever since, and finally they're coming down in price, and they still are, and, you know, I was able to snag one. Um, this one comes from OWC. And this one is the 3G version, uh, because the Mac Pro only takes up to SATA 2, whereas the newer uh, MacBook Pros go up to SATA 3, as well as I think the iMac. I also got this adapter, which you can get also from uh, MacSales.com, OWC. This one's made by Newer Tech, and basically it's going to allow me to install this 2.5 uh, inch drive, put it into a 3.5 form, and that should then be able to slot it right in. So without further ado, I'm just, I mean, you guys all seen this before, the numbers are all out, so there's really nothing new. I'm just gonna install it, and then I'm just gonna see how fast it boots and show you guys how, how well this works. All right, here we go. Alrighty, so I'm gonna just do a really quick test here, um, standard test. I'm going to load up my Mac Pro. It's going to open up Google Chrome, Final Cut Pro 7, as well as Adobe Photoshop CS 5 right as, um, right as the system starts up, and we will see how long it takes. Here we go. Google Chrome just loaded on the other screen. All right, looks like we were probably a little bit less than two minutes. I don't know why this didn't show up. But um, yeah, so that's what it is with the regular hard drive. Next, we will try it with the SSD. All right, now that I got the SSD uh, all installed as well as the software, we will do the exact same test. Loading up, opening up Final Cut Pro as well as Photoshop. So here we go. And there we go. We have Photoshop all ready to go already, as well as Final Cut Pro in just about 30 seconds. That is pretty darn impressive. Um, I mean, all the SSDs have already shown just how fast they are, so this shouldn't really be a big surprise. But you know, uh, maybe you still are on the ball about an SSD. Uh, I mean, until I get to use it a little bit more, I'm not quite sure how much you know, productive I will be, but the speed is definitely very, very 
very uh, impressive. So if you guys have any questions, just leave a comment down below. Um, I'll answer them as best as I can. And other than that, subscribe to our channel, like our videos, and we will get back to you with more uh, reviews, little shorts, and anything else that we might be doing. All right, peace out.